welcome or welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be showing you how i achieve a braid out on my type 4 natural hair so guys i want to apologize because i'm not going to be able to show you guys this time around how i made these braids i actually filmed it but unfortunately i lost most of the footage while transferring i think i might have messed something up while i was transferring the file i worked so hard on the video i was really excited about editing it but unfortunately <sighs> it is what it is but then i don't want uh, content to go to waste so i thought to still show you guys how i take down my braids so you guys can still see the outcome and in the meantime i'm still going to show you guys the product i used i just did my braids just the normal way so the first product i'm going to be showing you guys is this olive oil ors smooth and hold pudding this was a gift from a friend because it wasn't working out for her hair so it's actually my first time using it so we're gonna see the results today it moisturizes shines holds and hydrates your hair according to the label on it and second to it i use this 100% um, castor oil i just put it in this oil applicator bottle here that is what here and i applied it you know on my scalp and that's all i actually use for this hair next time i do this hairstyle i'm going to show you guys and also if you don't know i believe i have another braid out video on my channel that was actually my first braid out ever and <laughs> to me that if i watch that video i'm usually cringy but i just left it on my channel you know for growth sake to watch myself just to be able to look back and be proud of how far i've come so i just left it there <laughs> but yeah this will be my third braid out the second one wasn't on camera it wasn't perfect but i'm I was still very happy with my result and I believe I'm gonna keep finding new tricks as I keep going. So basically, I've had these braids on for 10 days. Initially, when I made these braids, I actually made it with beads. I took off the beads yesterday, two days ago rather, because I was getting tired of it. It kept making so much noise in my ears and I had cramps and I was more cranky. So I had to take it down. <laughs> so anyways, I thought to switch it up a bit today and I'm going to be taking down the braids i'm excited and i hope it comes out nice because as i said this is my third braid ever and you can never predict things with natural hair you know so to start this i'm going to be pouring some oil on my hand just some little i was like three or four drops of oil crystal oil and i'm going to start taking down my braids Hey guys, while I do this, I'm just going to entertain myself because this might be a while. So I'm just going to watch something on my phone while doing this. By the way, I'm watching Grey's Anatomy. I started it all over again from season 1. And in 2 weeks right now, going to 3 weeks, I'm in season 6 already. That's crazy. I don't know why I'm hooked on this show. <laughs>
guys i'm done taking out all the braids this is what my hair is looking like right now um the next thing i'm gonna do is take this um africom yeah this africom and pick my hair i'm just simply going to take it from the root pick it up give it that extra volume you can see this side is more up than this side because i've not touched this side yet so i'm just gonna pick 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 till i feel like it's done you see the difference yeah final result so honestly guys on a normal day like what i did with my last breath out i even stretched it out with my dryer but today i'm not really feeling it i i'm not feeling like using the dryer to stretch out my breath out so i think i'm gonna leave it like this i'm actually feeling it like this i am happy with the results to be honest um it's not perfect and i believe it doesn't have to be perfect but I love it i'm feeling it my hair is at awkward length right now which is why sometimes whenever i make hairstyles like this i usually feel weird i don't know but lately i'm getting used to the look of my awkward length hair i'm just gonna leave it like this it's cute it's nice one thing i learned by the way that i wanted to mention to you guys is um I noticed there were some parts I made the braid bigger than the others, some parts were extremely tiny, some parts were a bit more thick. One thing I learned is that the parts that were too tiny are the parts that were a bit less defined. For example, these front parts. I don't know if that is obvious. Or somewhere here at the back, it's not so defined. But then when you look at these back parts, like they are more defined more visible like it's a braid out you know it, it's it's giving the braid out braid out braid out vibe you get so that's one thing i learned basically so i think for next time if i'm gonna do this hairstyle again or when i'm gonna do this hairstyle again i'm definitely going to go with the size i went with somewhere here and do that all over my head instead of doing the tinier ones this ones too are not so bad don't get me wrong it's not bad but i think i like what this one is giving than this let me know how you guys feel about this video in the comment section okay i can go anywhere in this if i want to go out it's just to dress up look cute and my hair is good to go if you feel like stretching your hair you can also go ahead to do that i did that the last time as i said but i just don't feel like doing it now but next time i'll probably do it and if you guys specifically want to see me do that let me know in the comment section and i'll make a video specifically for that i hope you guys enjoyed this video even though i couldn't make the old full stuff like show you guys how i did the main braid i hope this was still kind of helpful yeah this is the end of the video guys i'm going to go ahead to take some thumbnail picture probably put on a little bit of makeup you know look a little bit cold to make sure to leave me a comment subscribe you know share this with your friends and your family and i will see you all in my next kisses <laughs>